Hi, I'm Gina. I'm Charlie. Charlie, did you know that this week is Shark Week? It began on July 23rd. Yeah, sharks are special type of fish and they live in the ocean. They live in many oceans and there are some that live in lakes and rivers around the world. These fascinating creatures have been around for at least 450 billion years. Oh, my! Is that older than dinosaurs? Yes, it's older than dinosaurs. Even though the sharks are technically a fish, they have distinct differences that set them apart from other fish. Do you know some of them, Charlie? They don't have thumbs in their dotties. That's right. Their skeleton is made up of a tough white tissue that's called cartilage. Just like our ears and nose, right? Exactly. They also have uh, more gill slits than other fish. What? Other fish only have one gill slit on each side of their head. Sharks can have up to 15 which makes it easier for them to filter oxygen out of the water. Oh, wow. And sharks have the large range of dotty shapes. Mostly their shape is torpedo shape. This helps them to move quickly through the water. All sharks have evolved over a million years. They have many different species of sharks some as small as your hand, and some as large as a bus, a school bus. Oh, wow, that's huge. The bigger the fish in the world is called, or the biggest fish in the world is called the whale shark. They can grow up to 33 feet long. That's correct. And they can weigh up to 41,000 pounds. That's heavier than 200 people. Yes, you're right. Whale sharks have been unique pattern on their skin. And marine biologists say that each pattern on a shark is unique, just like a fingerprint. Do you know that there's over 400 species of sharks that have been discovered so far? And that doesn't even include the ones that are extinct. That's correct. Some species are so rare, just like the great white shark. Others are more common, like the dogfish shark and the bull shark. That's right, bull shark. I wonder if he's stubborn like a bull. <laughs> I don't know, but he surely is. <laughs> And did you know that their eyes have a reflective layer that goes over it? It's called the tapetum. It helps them see in really dark places. Oh, like the dot on the ocean where the sunlight doesn't come? Exactly. And if you know, um, their eyes are the only organ, or yeah, are the only organ that makes them so special. Yeah, you know what? When they attack something, they close their eyes. You know why they do that? It's so that when they attack something and they close their eyes, it protects their eyes from anything that might shoot over into their eyes. Oh, wow, that's interesting. I know something else you don't know. What? Their skin is very, very rough, like a cat's tongue. Or sandpaper? Yes, it's just real rough. Well, did you know, um, that, well, <laughs> that's what I was going to tell you. Um, their, their skin has these little, um, like teeny weeny, scale like things and it helps them um, be able to maneuver fast too. Oh yeah and you know what they're also known for their scary teeth. <laughs> that just went woof right over your head. 
Yeah, some have jagged triangular teeth and others have long, tiny, pointed teeth. Whale sharks have over 3,000 tiny teeth. That's right. It helps them filter um, the little creatures that they eat because they don't eat big prey. They eat the plankton and the krill and even fish eggs. Fish eggs? Yep. Because anything that's small, they just, you know, suck that on in and it goes through their little teeth and it helps them. Ah, well, the great white sharks have large teeth. That's right, it helps them hunt for food. Like sea lions and seals. That's right. Sharks have rows and rows and rows of teeth. So when their front teeth start falling out, their other teeth come back. And did you know that they can go through over 50,000 teeth in a lifetime? That's a lot of teeth. Yes. And many believers think sharks are very vicious. And they're not, not, they don't normally attack people. Sometimes they do. Well, it's usually because of mistaken identity. Oh, you think they think they see a sea lion or something? Yeah, or some kind of other prey, but they're not setting out to attack people. It's just they're looking up and they see something that might look like a seal or something, and of course they're going to attack it. So we've got to be proactive and careful when we're swimming in their oceans because lately they've been kind of coming on up to the sh more shallow water. So if you have to go out, if you're going to the beach and everything, just watch for sharks and um, just be safe. Yeah, be safe. So, um, you know, sharks are not mean or evil, you know, by nature. So they have a particularly important job bringing balance into our ocean's ecosystem. Wow, I learned something new. That's right. I hope you learned a lot today, and I hope you guys did too. Charlie, thank you so much for doing this video with me. Oh, you're welcome, Miss Gina. And I hope you all learned a lot today. I'll see you later. Bye, see ya. Bye, see ya. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Did I do this? Yeah, I think you did. I just forgot.